Hello and welcome back to Knit Underground. It's been a while for me, but of course not for you as always, but because of that three episode stunt that I pulled last time, I haven't had to record this game in over a week. Well actually, a week, exactly. So I don't really remember what the hell I was doing, but I guess I'll just do what you always do in Knit Underground. Explore! So there was one thing that I kind of want to try. Where was that again? Yeah. Oh, it's the circle thing. Yeah. Let's go to the circle thing. That is the uh, entrance to the disorder on the map you see underneath. There's like a round thingy. Those just symbolize where you can enter the disorder. And I just kind of want to try that. Also, it's really early, kind of. It's like afternoon, but normally I record in the evenings, so... I think I still have a bit of morning voice, so might sound a bit more rough than usual. We'll see. But yeah, I'm probably not gonna do anything in the disorder. I just kind of want to try it out and see if I can figure anything out so far, or if you have to just leave it for later. Uh, where is it? Yeah, this way. This way and then up. Ah, uh, there. Yeah, this is it. There we go. Hello, Mr. Epsilon. Also, I think... I think this might be something about the disorder. Freezing on top of the writing. Maybe. We'll, we'll see. I don't remember much about the disorder, how it worked, how it looked. We'll just see. We are ready? Sure, let's do it. Okay. So I have one minute. It's more colorful than I remembered. So like here's one. But do I want to exit there? Oh, writing. Freeze. Oh. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, I never understood that in my last time playing this. Uh, I would like to go to that disorder pillar thing. Because I... Yeah, I thought it was like bugged or something, but it probably wasn't. I was just not understanding it properly. So, up here should be a disorder thingy? No. Was it above? Where was it? Oh right, no, it's not like the next screen, because everything in the disorder is much, much more compressed. It's like, uh, think the nether in Minecraft or whatever, where one screen equals many more screens in the uh, disorder, because it's, like, condensed. So I might not be able to get to the uh, disorder pillar that I saw. Yeah, this is just a save point. I see, okay, but hold on, I'm actually just gonna restart and try this again, because I probably won't use the disorder, because I'm I'm a hoarder and I don't want to use up those crystals, even though there's no point saving them. I vaguely remember you getting some sort of special crystal that you could just use infinitely, and I'm probably just gonna wait until I get that, because I, I'm pretty sure I can just get that without wasting anything, so to speak. Alright, let's do this again. And I'll head this way, I guess. Go down here. Here's one of these, yeah. I kept trying to go. Wait. Yeah, that's exactly what happened, and I couldn't understand why. So I thought, oh, you have to freeze on these, but you don't. It doesn't do anything for you. So. That's why I didn't understand the disorder when I played my first time. We should be running out of time soon-ish. 
So there's like... There's many ways you can enter the disorder, but only a few that you can actually exit it. So far I haven't even seen more than that one. I haven't found any writing. Guess I'll go down here. I think I'm running out of time. Yeah, I'm running out of time. What's happening? I can't see a thing! We failed to reach an exit in time. Don't worry, in a second we'll be back in the real world. I think... Me, before we try this again, you might want to learn more about the disorder first. Well, I don't... I don't need to, but... I will. I will actually do that, so I'm just gonna not use the disorder for now. I know you have to use it to uh, get the secret ending thing, or if there... I don't know if there is a secret ending, but I know there's an achievement, at least. But yeah, we'll see about that. For now, I guess I'll just start exploring things again, so let's go... Uh... Up, I guess? Sure, let's go up. Why not? Why not? Actually, this is going back. Can I... Can I get past this? Oh, I can. Yeah, nice. Yep, no problem there. Oh, and I can get up here now. Yeah, this is where the uh, invisible wall was when I got here last time. And there's nothing except the power. What is this power? Whoops, wrong button. It's the uh, shooty power. Okay, so do I do... Do I go here? And try to shoot this guy? Oh yeah, I do! There's a thing up there! I didn't even see that! Oh, I see. Okay, let's try to do that. I don't know what it is. I don't know if I need it. I probably do. But, might as well get it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, damn. Oh, that's good. So I should just kill myself because then I just get back here. Take that, damn it! <laughs> okay, I understand. You're just supposed to sort of let it go and let it do its own thing. Ah, oh, shit, that was, that was poor. Yeah, you don't have to use anything here. You can just let the ball bounce. There we go. Nice. And I got a coin. Alright, it's a gold coin. Bronze coin, never mind. Many sprites rely on human money, blah 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 blah. Okay, great. So that's something. Uh, can I shoot anything over here? Doesn't look like it, so I won't bother getting the power again. Don't think there's anything, like, to the right here. I guess I'll just check. Not from what I can tell. Maybe... Oh, shit. Maybe, like, up here? No. Maybe... Hold on. Ah, damn. I don't think there's anything here. I'm just gonna leave it for now. As I said many, many, many times, I'll look for more secrets later on when I've done more map completion. Hello, fairies, pixies, whatever. They won't talk to me. Alright, never mind then. So I could climb up to the right here, but I guess I'll just see if anyone wants to talk first. Hi, hello. Chico, that look, you must be one of the sprockets, but that can only mean... The gods answered my prayers! They sent you to come help me. Ah, uh, Celia? Oh, no, that's just a coincidence. Or that's just a coincidence. No way! A while back I found a rare and beautiful ring, but today one of those thieving bird creatures took it. The ring is important to me, but I can't I just can't reach the bird's nest. I don't climb that well, so I decided to pray. I barely get started, and you guys show up. So, when you pray, any random person who walks by is because of divine intervention? Interesting. 
I guess the key to believing in miracles is to have really, really low expectations. A sprocket with flying powers doesn't qualify as any random person. Oh, I, I thought it was going to be a question, that's why I read it that way, whatever. You have to admit, it can't be coincidence. Wouldn't the gods send someone who believes in them? Of course not! They could have sent a myriadist counselor, but how, how would that help me? You're here for a reason, so your reward doesn't have to wait. Take this, the Kaushiki Stone will bring you victory. Wow, a stone with fake powers! You'll help me, right? Sure, I guess. Alright, why not? Me thinks we should help you. Personally, I just keep the reward and run off. I wonder what happens if you do that. I'm kind of curious. There's so many things that I want to try in this game. Maybe I'll just play through like five billion times. We'll see. Celia, really? You hate it when people take advantage of others. That's different. When someone goes, take this payment, now go help me, that doesn't oblige us to. Okay, great. It's it's a coin? Again? No, it's not. It is a Kaushiki stone. Right, you told me that. Meridus believe this stone brings victory to its owner. And, oh. Look, the ring! It teleported onto your finger. What? Whoa, wait. I don't see it. Oh, I see. Ha <laughs> ha. Great. Good job, Celia. Okay, and the ring is above. Yeah, okay. So I just have to climb the thing that I said I would climb, but I wouldn't climb before I wanted to talk to people, or before I talked to people, so... Convenience! That is exactly what I wanted. Oh, but this isn't the way I get up, because you have to go the other way around. I see. I have a high jump power. Don't know if I need that or something. Okay, I guess I'll go do whatever this is first. Okay, so I got that. And then why why would you have to like go the other way again? I am a little bit confused by all these powers, but that's fine. I'm gonna check for secrets here. Nothing that I can see. Alright, and can I take this one somewhere? Oh! This isn't where I came from? Right, I came from a secret thing. I don't know where I'm going right now. Uh, I'm just gonna go back and see if I can climb around that big open area. Nope. Do you need it to get up here? Oh, I guess you do, yeah, because you can't get up here otherwise. Okay, so instead I will go this way. Okay, there's a flying power there. Oh! Hello? Joanna! Hey, you! Care to do business? A simple delivery is all we ask for, says Xuan, or Xuan, I don't know. Uh, sure, Celia, go. I'm just gonna go with Celia for basically everything, I think. Avocado? What? Hmm, what? You're too small to carry it. We need to talk to the sprite. No, I do the talking. Fine, we brought two coins here, like we always do. One for the blah, one for the fruit? That's hard to say for me. One for the delivery. We purchased an avocado from the farmer. Now the delivery guy says he won't accept coins any longer. So he can never do business with a fairy again. His loss. No, our loss. He's the town's only delivery guy. What are we gonna do? If sprites stop accepting coins. Come on, it's just that one idiot. Pick an internet village instead and do your trading there. They don't believe in gods, yet they practically worship anything human-made. Perhaps a single coin gets you even more food. No, internets are just unpredictable. They say the glyphs, the glyphs on coins mean things. Yeah, and that they can't agree on what. Sometimes a coin gets us loads of fruit, sometimes none at all. And we need to make sure we have enough money for the, deli de 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 the delivery, too. Well, you aren't doing much better here. Now, that depends. Are you willing to deliver this avocado? Sure, why not? Sure, we'll do it. Bring it to Oslo. We're paying you up front with this coin so we don't have to carry it back. 
Yeah, coins are heavy. We trust that you will deliver it. I said we'll do it. Great, okay, so I got an avocado. When did I get this? Oh, that's what I picked up in the, the thing up to the right. Man Manassa stone. Mira disbelieved that this stone has a connection to snakes. Whether this is a good or bad stone is still subject to discussion. And I got a silver coin. Great. And avocado. Humans ate them like snacks. Sprites eat them as meals. Okay. Fairies feed off them for a week. Yeah, makes sense. Hi, how's it going? Aren't you supposed to be delivering that avocado already? Just take it easy, okay? I'm on it. Don't worry. It's probably gonna spoil before I get it to the, the person, though. Okay, so I guess I have to go up here, probably, to do the, uh, climby thing. Maybe not. I can go this way, at least. Because this is where I couldn't go with the ball power. Okay, I can open this. Oh, I see. Okay. And then I just do this kind of thing. Yeah, like that. And then... I kind of want to do just... That. And then I can do this. And fly even further. Didn't need it, though, but still. Oh, perfect. Great. That's exactly what I wanted. And I got the ring. The ring says... Ring! A beautiful ring! Great. I'll just open this. And we'll give the ring back. Hi. We found your ring. Do you still believe this is just a coincidence? Bring that up with a ce celestial teapot. Oh, I see. Yeah. The what? Anyway, thanks for the help. You should look that up. It's... What is it called again? I don't know. It's it's some metaphor. The teapot thing. It's not... I don't know. I don't know the name of it. doesn't really matter. Uh... So where to now? Where do I want to go now? I kind of feel like going up more, to the right, so I might just do that. I like the song a lot, too. I mean, you kind of have to, uh, I think you can get the OST for free? I might be wrong on that, but I think you can get the uh, soundtrack for this game completely free if you go to Niflis' site, niflis.ni.se, I think it is, something like that, or... Wait, what is it? NI2? I don't know, it's in the description. But if you go there, you can actually find the uh, soundtrack for this game. I think it's free, and it's really good, and... I mean, in my videos, I have to sort of tone down the, uh, the music, because otherwise everything would just overpower myself and my voice. So, you can't really accurately gauge all the sounds and music and all that in any game, really, when you're watching a Let's Play on YouTube. So, I really suggest you getting the, uh, the soundtrack to this game. It's super, super good. Okay, I guess I'll go up here. This is the, uh, the laboratory, or laboratory. So I guess everything we were doing was actually underground, I mean, it's called underground, but this is like getting closer to the surface, but it's still underwater, and this is like the underwater laboratory in within a deep forest. So, let's see, I got... Oh, I got another silver coin, I see, okay. And there's nothing else up here, can't climb up higher. Nope, nothing, all right. And that's it. Okay. Got a coin. Sweet. I'll check this out as well. If this is the song that I think it is, it's really good once it gets going. We'll see. Okay, so what's this? Some sort of terminal. 
No, it's nothing. Alright. Yep, this is the song. I love the song. I think this is from within the deep forest. Okay, so these... Oh, I see. These are harmful, but I can hang on to this thing. Oh, shit. Alright, I see how this works. Wait, do I even need this thing? I guess I do. Probably just a little bit. I can probably just do this. Whoops, maybe not, but something like that. Ah, damn it! There we go, perfect. Okay, I could go to the right, let's just climb up for now. Yeah, if I didn't convince you to get the soundtrack yet, this should convince you. Okay, what do I need this for? Maybe just getting up here, I guess? I see. So I need to somehow... Yeah, there we go. There we go, nice. Yeah, I love this sort of platforming in this game. Here's another place to enter the Disorder. Don't really need it at the moment. And? What's this? It is an L! Corner piece, the top right piece of a puzzle. Okay. And dead end! Weird. And down here is nothing. Basically just a one-way path. And a save point. I think I might just end it there for today then. So, great! We're exploring the underwater laboratory. 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 I can never decide how to pronounce that, and I probably will say it both ways every time. I don't know. But thanks for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for more Knits Underground and more random exploration and jumping around and puzzling and powers and all that good stuff. See you then! Bye bye!